Good afternoon, everybody. Let's see if it's gonna turn around. Okay, there we are. Hi. Wow, that light's bright. Hi, everybody. All right, and so I said I would scope later, and I'm running out of time. So you guys have to like come join me while I finish my makeup and curl my hair. <laughs> Because I'm running out of time. How's everybody's afternoon going? Start pouring. Hey Alice, how are you? Yeah, but I have like daylight lights in my bathroom so that I could see when I'm doing my makeup, but it's not really great for the camera, so you'll have to bear with me. You're shopping. Hey Sophia. Hey Daphne. Daphne, I haven't been able to look and see what A5s. Alice, it's coming, I promise. You got one of your packages. <laughs> so why are you complaining? You got one, right? My hubby. You guys see my laundry I need to put away? It's on my bed. You didn't? I thought you did. I'll have to look. I thought you had one already sent out. Oh no, it's sent. That's what I'm... Um, zig pins. Zig pins work really well. <laughs> okay, cool. Go take a shower. You need to do the same. What? Get ready? Oh, okay, Alice. I'm following. Well, then do your hair and makeup while you watch my periscope. Ooh, nice. Like date night going out or uh, just going out? Oh, thanks. Thank you. the best, right? Hi from Dublin, Ireland. Hello, how are you? Um, do you guys schedule date nights for you and your husband? Do you guys like make sure you put them on the calendar? Hey Tracy. I'm like looking in the mirror and trying. Well, thank you. Good. You should. You should do it. You should schedule date nights. Even if it's just once a month, you should put it on the calendar and make it a priority. Yeah, we, we try. <laughs> Lately, we've been really busy. Um, I used to be useless at eyeshadow, but I've been practicing. And... Making myself do my makeup every single day. Hey Lauren, how are you? Do my guys. It does take practice, right? And I have to admit, I was not um, good at it at all. And so I've been really, really practicing. Yeah. You know, even if you have to do it at home, you just have that time set aside. YouTube videos, those are magical. YouTube videos are magical when it comes to makeup, right? Because you can learn so much. And it's not necessarily the product they're using always, um, but their techniques. Hi, Brittany. Okay, I'm totally not flipping you guys off, promise. So what are you guys doing today? Has it been a good Saturday so far? I got a ton of work done. 
For finding good drugstore makeup? Oh, cool. Six degrees and sunny. Awesome. Cleaning all day. You have to be exhausted. Tracy, seriously? Are you lucky? It is. Yeah, I was going to say, it's getting late in Dublin. I'm pretty sure my friend in Luxembourg, I'm pretty sure she's asleep now. Um, we are heading out to, our friends have, are having a vow renewal ceremony. And, well, they did that and then they're just doing the reception. Nice. No, well, it was sunny and then it started raining. So. Cool. Outdoor tools. Bye. Oh, I love, you. love you. Have fun. Thank you. I want to know when you get when you guys get back. Well, I'll tell you. I'll text you. All right. You better. Stay on budget. You got snow today. Snow? Seriously? Actually, you know what? They said on the news that it might snow. Yeah. Hi, Amy. It's supposed to snow. And only an inch. I know, but still. Exactly. Exactly. But still. It's a little ridiculous. Yeah, it's supposed to snow tomorrow. Or late tonight. We'll see. All right, we're going to do some mascara, and then I need to curl my hair real quick. We already picked up the wine, so we don't have to do that. And we sent the kids. Oh, yeah, Amy, I totally watched your scope when I was dying laughing. Dying. I didn't even consider going because I will have a baby. So I'm not going for, I bet he's so mad. So I'm not going to go for a one day conference. Not this year. Not this coming year. Hello, Allison. How are you? Oh yeah, somebody's bound to sell their tickets, Amy, seriously, to anything and everything like that. Everybody's like, they'll get a ticket and then they're like, oh, I can't go, like I, something came up. I didn't look at my dates correctly, so. <laughs> In Australia, it is a new one, right? So somebody will cancel and have tickets to sell. For sure. All right, we're going to let those dry because I need to brush them out. What type of gift? 10 years. Ooh. What's 10 year anniversary? I don't know what that is. But I would be like a really pretty frame of some sort or something like that. That's what I would do for a 10 year. If I was bringing a gift. We're not allowed to bring. Yeah. Really, really pretty. Like do an upscale frame. We're just bringing a bottle of wine because she said no gifts. But she's one of my best friends and I don't listen to her. <laughs> so, yep, they always say no gifts. They always say no gifts. And then we still bring them stuff. So, yeah, Tracy, I really, I can even picture in my head just a really pretty frame would be perfect for that. Oh my gosh. Well, what a great opportunity to uh, celebrate and do their vow renewal. That's so sweet. That is so sweet. 
For those of you who've been married for a really long time, have you ever considered doing a vow renewal? Just, just to do it? Oh, it was, I'm sorry. You could try it again, but use some product in your hair. That sometimes helps. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, some some people, it's a reason to do it. Oh, yeah, you caught me. I apologized. Should get a slap on the hand, right? Honey, I'm scoping. <laughs> Don't. <laughs> Five years? Oh. Yeah, I'm sure they can hear you. He's a naughty boy. That's awesome. That's awesome. You should do it big, right? I have to get this out of my way. It's causing problems. 20 years. That's a long time. Oh, cool. Yeah, he is. He's not even nice. Oh, wow. I'm sorry to hear that. Hopefully you guys are doing well, though. Sorry, I'm like, I didn't realize how hard it would be to, uh, like, talk while I'm curling my hair. Go figure. <laughs> yeah, has anybody ever tried doing that? Let's hold a conversation. Yeah. Yeah, no, I hear you. That was the plan of what you guys wanted to do. I get it. Um, do you guys ever talk about what you want to do when you retire? Like some people, like when they retire, couples, they want to um, do their own thing, have their own hobbies. We want to, um, a couple things. So we want to own an RV so we can drive around the United States, and go anywhere we want and go visit all of our kids. You're moving someplace warm. And then we want to have an isolated cabin up in the mountains looking down on everything. But I told him my only requirement is it has to have Wi-Fi. <laughs> so those are the two things that we want to do. Yeah, so I just want to be able to like pull up into my kid's driveway. Just park the RV. Hey, Shani. So, totally exactly what I want to do. What's up? Yeah, RVs are awesome. RVs rock. We, as a kid, we used to take a two-week vacation in an RV because we had a huge family, so it was really the only way we could do it, and it was the best thing ever. They're so much fun. It's like a little mini house on wheels. And it was such a good time. And you would think that being that close to each other, you'd like get on each other's nerves, but we ended up actually getting along better than we did at our homes, our house. So it was nice. Yeah, it's funny how vacations have changed since I was a kid. I mean, really. Well, I practice a lot. <laughs> Cause I don't like when you're like hanging down straight. Yeah, great memories, right? Great memories. But vacations have changed. Vacations have completely changed nowadays. They're so different. And I don't know that it's good or bad. I just think that it's just, they're different. They're just really different. So, my entire family, we like to try to vacation every couple of years together. Um, I would 
say they are a little bit more family focused than activity focused. I think. Like instead of, you know, the destination really wasn't that big of a deal. It was that you were with your family, or at least in our family it was. I mean, we didn't really go, like, go specifically to do something. We just spent time together as a family. They were simpler. A lot of ours were um, church-based, too. We went on a lot of church-based vacations. And I still call them vacations because they were fun. And we got to see our friends and hang out. Yeah, it is true. Oh yeah, I don't want to run around. I don't want to drive when I'm on vacation. That's why I like cruises or destination places because I want it all inclusive. I don't want to be traveling every day to go eat someplace. Yeah, just family being together. So I don't want to do all this because as a mom, right, that's not really relaxing, is it? I mean, come on, let's be real. Vacations are not a mom's best friend. They still want to hear. <laughs> yeah, well, they hire a super duper travel agent like Amy. <laughs> but no, it's expensive. It's expensive. Even a simple vacation. So we rented a cabin, not last year, but the year before. Hey, Wendy. And even that wasn't that cheap. I mean, we had the cabin expense and we had to buy all the food and we had activities. But I like, yeah, I like to vacation someplace where I have a kitchen still. Because <laughs> I don't want to eat out the whole entire time. Cruises are amazing. I've been on one and I would do it over and over and over. No, nope, you have to get a suite, right? Yeah, happy Saturday. Um, <laughs> yeah, so I like cruises and then I went, or destination like all inclusive where the meals are included, that kind of stuff. Or you have to give me a place with a suite so I can cook part of my meals. I know, let's go, serious. Next year, Amy, I'm going on vacation next year. I'm telling you, right now. <laughs> well, I think you're done for this year, right? It would be fun though, wouldn't it? <laughs> oh, that's what we were thinking about too. No, I wanna cruise. I know we were supposed to go on a cruise until this baby decided to come yeah you have two already yeah you have two more this year that's what I'm saying is you're kind of booked already this year yep we were gonna go on cruise we were gonna go on a family moon I'm gonna call it family moon because we were gonna take all the kids with us and no, we are doing a family moon. So now, because God decided to bless us with a child, we will not be doing that. Because I don't think that would be very fun with a newborn. So, we'll just have to delay it. Postpone. <laughs> yeah. No, not really. So we're going to postpone it and do something big next year is the plan. I can't see where my hair is parted. Quite entertaining, right? Watching me go from uh... yeah, it will be, it will be. And then 2000. See, 2017. So 2018, our daughter graduates, so we have to figure out something for that. Because that will be the last vacay with her, probably. <laughs> and 
And then we'll have to plan, like, next year will be, like, my 40th birthday getaway or whatever after. Or we'll go skiing for my birthday. Wouldn't that be cool? Skiing. All right, y'all. Does anybody ski in here? Do I ski or snowboard? No. Oh my gosh, it's so much fun. Yay. No. It's a blast. You're not great at it. I'm not. I'm not great at it either. But I enjoy it. It's fun. Don't break up though. <laughs> Snowboarding's easier on your knees than um, skiing. Yeah, it is. It is a lot of fun. <laughs> Come back in a body bag. <laughs> oh, that would be fun. No, not, not that you come back in a bag. Oh, well, thank you. I think my daughter probably would be. She's really clumsy. She gets it from me honestly so okay we're done all we need is fix eyebrows I mean fix eyelashes thank you so we have fixed eyelashes put some lipstick on and head out so I'm gonna say goodbye thank you I have my new maternity top on let's see if you guys can see it can you see it no the comments it's like has lace and sheer stuff on the bottom can't really see it but We'll try. It's pouring down raining outside, so we'll see. Yay! Cool. All right, guys. I'll see you later. Might scope later tonight. Thanks. <laughs> you guys are sick. All right. Love ya. See you later tonight.